Alright guys, what is up? It is your boy Poe Pro broadcasting from the Poe Production Studios. And we're doing a little bonus video here for the Trials of Mana. There's a secret boss to the left, right here in the Dragon's Cove, after you defeat the Crimson Wizard, aka Karen. I rather call him Karen because that's not stupid. Anyway, what you need to do first is make sure you have a great supply of items. I have all my scales, I have Poto oils. I have Specter Eyes, which cast Dispel Magic because the Black Rabbi likes to buff his stats. And you need a whole bunch of medical herbs. Also, having Cup of Wishes isn't bad either, so have your supplies ready. But this is more important. You want to go into your menu here and select No Moves. Do not! set a level 1, 2, or 3 tech move in there, because the Black Rabbi will always counterattack it. So make your characters just hack and slash away. The way to beat this guy is technically by using you know, the most basic form possible. Honestly, I think this boss is just set for, uh, you know, it's all counterattacking. So, and the level in the Black Rabbi is at level 99. I'm at level 47. So let's see if I can beat him. I've never beaten him before, but I have seen videos of people doing it, and I'm trying to go by what I've learned from them. So wish me luck, guys. Oh, also another thing. Make sure it's nighttime. Oh, it's daytime right now. Oh no, Poe Pro, whatever shall we do? <laughs> That would have been kind of stupid if I went in there without checking the day. You go all the way to the bottom, get my Dream Sea Herb, or sorry, let me get my Dream Read. Because we have to change the name of this thing for no reason at all. And we're going to make it nighttime. If I'm not able to change it to nighttime right now, I'm just going to rage quit. There we go. It's nighttime. Now let me get rid of my dream reads, because God knows I'm not going to need them for this fight. And let me get my medical herbs. Alright, wish me luck guys, we're going in there. There's something here. The hardest boss of the game, the Black Rabbi. Alright, so first things first. You know what, I'm going to do this first. I'm going to cast this spell on him. So all this in the video, apparently it helps. So everyone's going to get their scales right now. We're going to up everyone's attack with Drake scales. Sahagin chip? Sahagin. I still can't say it. Sahagin chip. That boosts our magic defense. Alright. Now we're all going to get the let scales. Oh, sorry, these are beak scales. So one for Angela, this is going to increase her evade rate and also increase her hit rate. One for Kevin. And let me get one for Duran. Let me 
get a bullet skill for Duran. One for Angela. And one for Kevin. Alright, I think we are ready to attack this guy. We just use a Poto Oil. Heal everyone a little bit. I like how none of my teammates are attacking this guy. Alright, there we go. Cast a little moon energy on Kevin. Cast a little bit on Duran. And you know what, why not? We'll cast it on Angela too. We don't want to leave her left out. Despite the fact she's the weakest of the three of us. And the key is never, ever, ever use any of your physical techs. Just keep beating them up. Because he's very reaction based. If you use hardcore attacks on him, he will react to those. Now I could do a lightsaber spell. Maybe I'll do that. Holy Sangeeper! Holy Diver! Now, for all I know, it's probably like messing this fight up or something like that. Why can't I have go on Duran? Come on, Duran, do your thing, buddy. See, it's funny, like when Duran's casting spell and I'm in control of him, they all just watch him. Let me cast it on Angela as well. And hopefully we should wreck shop with this guy, if I'm lucky. I've never beaten the Black Rabbit before. Now the problem is he is still going to do some of his spells, like Psycho Wave, and he's going to use that black magic to heal himself. But he's not going to do it as well. Uh, real quick, let me heal with Duran. We're going to heal Angela, just because she's a little low on her HP right now. figure out how to manipulate this game, you could beat it easily. Or stand a chance against him, I should say. I'm casting about 200 damage every time Kevin hits him. Right, I'm gonna heal with Durant real quick. so far this black crab like we heal Kevin I'll give Angela a chocolate why not I don't have chocolate I forget it she doesn't get anything Okay, Psychic Blast, so he's going to knock us away, then he's going to cast Flash on us. So now we're all moogled, and he's going to try to heal himself. This is where I was getting stuck last time. 
So hopefully I'll be able to to undo all this. He's gonna cast more dark magic, but he's gonna cast it on himself. So right now I'm gonna use a couple Poto oils, let me heal myself. Alright, so now he's gonna cast a bunch of dark magic spells on himself to heal. Okay, that's new. He wasn't casting Stone Cloud the other time. Alright, that hurt a little bit, but not that bad actually. Oh, he summoned a, a level 99 demon. That's right, we can just beat him up. So he's summoning demons now. And we just murder that thing. He's gonna cast Spiral Moon. This attack sucks, this is gonna really hurt us. Wasn't too too bad. We'll heal again with a photo oil. I beam. Oh, that did hardly anything. And we should have an easy time. I think we're gonna beat him. So the thing I was doing wrong the other time was I was doing level 1 techs. You don't have, you want to do any techs against him. So he should eventually just die. Okay, he's casting Ancient. Yeah, he's, he's... I think he's starting to die right now, because he wasn't doing this the other time I tried fighting him. Dursh. That didn't even do all that much. I figured that would have decimated me. It's like 200 damage. That's nothing. It's like we're beating up a rabbit. Black Rabbi. And he's dead. Victory pose. You won. And you know what we got for that fight? Nothing. No experience. Nothing. Just knowing the fact that you beat the Black Rabbi. And on that note, this bonus video is done. Make sure you guys subscribe to Poe Productions on YouTube. And catch me later.